In this video, I will show you how to add a domain to Namecheap shared web hosting. You will need to make sure your DNS name servers are set to Namecheap web hosting DNS if you have a domain registered on Namecheap or DNS1.namecheaphosting.com and DNS2.namecheaphosting.com if you have your domain registered with another company. I will have both addresses listed in the description of this video below so you can just copy and paste them into your domain registrar. To change the name server on Namecheap, from your Namecheap dashboard, find the domain you wish to have in your shared web hosting account and click Manage on the right hand side of the domain. On this one I'm going to choose nosedogs.com and I'm going to click Manage. In the next screen that pops up, you will need to scroll down to the middle of the page and under Name Servers, you will need to change from Basic DNS to name cheap web hosting DNS. Be sure to click the check mark to save it and that's all you need to do. So now we're going to go back and we're going to go into your cPanel account. So you're going to want to go into your cPanel, go to cPanel and cPanel is going to load and now we're into Namecheap cPanel. Now I'm doing this on Namecheap if you have another web hosting company other than Namecheap and it does have cPanel, these cPanel options are going to be relatively the same. It may look a little bit different on yours than mine, but the same options should be there. So from the main cPanel screen, you're going to want to scroll down and find add-on domains. And we want to create an add-on domain. So in my case, the add-on domain is going to be nosedogs.com. So you want to type in your domain and hit the tab key. Notice after you hit the tab key, the other fields will be populated for you. The subdomain will be populated and the document root will be, will be populated. You do not need to change these at all. Just leave them the way it is and click add domain. Now this could take a few seconds, a few minutes to, t to do, so just wait it out, let it sit there, do not go off from this page or it will interrupt it. So just let it sit there and wait for it to go through. Like I said, it could take a couple minutes to go through. Okay, so now we see the add-on domain has been created. And if you would like to manage files for this domain, you can do so at File Manager. And it is enabling HTTPS. A great thing about Namecheap shared web hosting is that you get free SSL installation with these. So every time you put in a new domain, it's automatically going to install HTTPS. It could take up to 30 minutes for it to do that. So please, if you, if you create a site on WordPress, it could say that it's not secure for about 30 minutes to an hour or so, but it will install the secure SSL in there. So it could just could take just a little bit of time. And that's it. Your new domain has just been created. And if you look under uh, add-on domains, the domain is here and you can manage redirect if you want to redirect the domain you would have to manage redirection from here since it is now in your cPanel. If you found this video helpful to you please give this video a like below. If you want to see more videos like this hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.